Yo, how's it going, guys? Rebel here, coming to you with a brand new video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to craft the brand new Showdown Jorginho and Showdown Rice cards for very, very cheap or even free uh, with some tips that I'm going to give you guys, okay? But before we get into the video, go ahead and leave a like. Let's try to hit freaking... Uh, let's try to hit 35 likes on this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here. Uh, we upload FIFA 21 content every single day, and we're going to start showing you guys how to craft every SBC. Uh, but yeah, let's get into it, man. Okay, so like I said yesterday, um, I'm going to be repeating a little bit of the same stuff, but it does change this time because now we don't have the 80 plus player pick to craft towards Jorginho and Declan Rice. So we're going to have to limit our options to, you know, craft these guys and do it some other way, okay? So if we do take a look at both of these cards, Jorginho, in my opinion, looks like the better card. I don't know why he's, uh, I don't know why Declan Rice is more expensive. So, Jorginho, all you need for Jorginho is very, very simple. You just need an 86 overall squad. And then if you go to Declan Rice, Declan Rice, he needs an 82 and an 85. So, kind of maybe the same price, but, you know, all you need is like one more 90 rated card for Jorginho. And that rating goes up from an 85 to an 86. So, you know, kind of the same price here. I don't really know who's more expensive. I think Declan Rice probably is. But I think Jorginho is the better card. And, uh, you know let's just leave it at that okay so you guys want to find out how to get that 86 rated squad that is so easy guys that is so easy so the first thing i'm going to tell you guys like i always do is to make sure you're playing the game make sure you're playing rivals make sure you're playing champs squad battles uh draft and objectives if you're doing all this uh you're probably going to be able to complete them for free literally if you complete mina like <laughs> complete mina and then um i i'm gonna show you right now how to get complete them literally for free complete mina right get mina done literally get mina done uh, if you haven't done these milestones complete all these milestones right here all these right here and you will have enough to complete Jorginho, literally or declan rice you will you will have enough because that's a 95 rated car that's already a high high rating and then you're gonna have all those 82s 83s 84s that you're gonna pack from those packs that's gonna be amazing all right now just add in playing champs rivals and squad battles that's gonna be even crazier but if you guys want to take it a tad notch fur further and get it even easier, uh, you want to make sure if you're a brand new account, you just got the game, you're a Chelsea fan, you're an, you're Italian and you want to get Jorginho, complete your icon swaps. I'm telling you, if you complete just the 84 times 20, you're going to be able to complete Jorginho for free. It's same thing for the 83 times 25 and same things for the 81 sign times 25. So that's some very, very easy ways to get Jorginho. But let's say you don't want to do all that and you just want to grind the menus. Okay, well, the first tip that I'm going to give you guys is to make sure that you're actually just opening these packs. Okay, make sure that you're opening these packs, uh, the preview packs. And if you do get something good, maybe you get like a Neymar or a Lukaku or something, um, buy, buy the pack. Uh, right here, we don't even get a walkout, so we're not going to buy that. Uh, there was an ultimate pack in store earlier, though. We didn't get that. We got the Prime Gold Players pack right here. Let's see if we could hit anything in this. Hopefully, we get a Neymar. He's like literally extinct at 6 mil. No walkout, so that's all right. But this is what I always do. I always go ahead and open these because you never know what you're going to hit. Uh, there could be an icon behind this there could be a summer star behind this there could be a gold ronaldo behind this and that's some pretty good coins that you could use uh to you know craft any spc you want or buy any player you want in the game okay so you want to make sure you're doing that make sure you're opening these packs as well and this one is a little bit easier to craft than the correa and tiago silva yesterday i do think the correa and tiago silva yesterday were more expensive than these dudes uh so that's something you want to take into account when you're completing these guys they are pretty fairly priced an 86 rated uh squad for that Jorginho is pretty crazy uh let me know what you think about this jersey by the way psg jersey looks pretty fire no it looks pretty cool it looks pretty sick uh i think neymar and Mbappe wore this on the cover but we opened our preview packs we didn't get anything there so uh maybe if you guys hit something crazy let me know in the comments down below if you hit something crazy but the way that i'm going to be crafting for Jorginho, or if i would craft for Jorginho if i wanted to complete them would be to just open bronze packs and then do the bronze pack method and do the league spc method that's how i would do it to pack the cards if i just purely wanted to grind and i didn't want to play any foot champs gains and stuff like that okay so you want to just make sure you're opening bronze packs uh, i'd say open about maybe 20k or maybe 10k worth of bronze packs until you start getting duplicates and once you start getting dupes like this you're going to start listing all of them for min price um maybe even more if they sell for more all the celebrations you could sell for 200 so on this pack alone i'm making back 200 coins but i did get some players back into the club as you guys saw and um you're just gonna keep doing this like i said until you're getting lots of duplicates and you could switch up the method as well what i've been doing recently is i've been doing silver pack method and silver pack method has helped me a lot in getting those uh silver saudi cards or, or uh, bolivian cards so i just opened the 2500 silver pack uh every single day as well 
you know, you get a preview option. If you get a Saudi player, that's literally like a free 7, 8K. So right here, we don't really get anybody. You could compare prices. Uh, so for this one, I am probably going to buy this pack because I do see this whole city kit and I know this kit is going to sell. Uh, we got a badge right there. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy this pack for 2,500. Uh, I know this right back might sell for like 1K as well. So let me go ahead and see. Yeah, 750. We'll listen for like uh, 800. We could list this guy for like 700 and then we could list this guy for like 400. I know that's not all our coins back, but we do have a Scottish manager right here, which we are going to sell for a little bit. And then we do have this badge that is probably not going to sell, but the whole city kit is going to sell. So we are going to sell that. We made our coins back on that pack. So you could open silver packs as well. But once you guys put a lot of bronzes into your club, right? Once you have a lot of bronzes and you're ready to start doing the league SBC method, the ones that I always recommend guys is to make sure that you're doing the uh, African and America's and all that stuff you also want to make sure that you're completing these right here festival of football challenge festival of football challenge festival of football challenge i need to complete these before they expire uh you could do marquee matchups but like i said the ones that i'm really interested in is africa uh, america and europe so i'm almost done with americas i think i'm just gonna go ahead and buy the bolivian players i haven't packed them so what i'm gonna do is just straight up buy them it's okay it's like 10k 15k probably for both of them i don't really care i'll take that just so i could get the pack at the end and maybe pack something good uh if they're under nine oh they are not under 9k how much are they bolivian players are extinct or what okay yeah no no you don't want to pay 10k for a card to just no so i'm not going to pay 10k for that i'm just going to keep doing a uh, bronze pack method like i said hopefully i pack the card and another way that you could be uh packing those silvers and bronzes is to, is to be doing bronze upgrades right here okay so if you're doing bronze upgrades you're going to be able to get some pretty nasty stuff in this so romania i'm going to send that England, I'll send that because I don't think I'm going to use them. Um, we can get rid of Romania. Like I said, Romania is not even used. Ireland is not used. Uh, Estonia is not used. Ireland, Romania, Ireland. And then we'll give up one more nation. Probably like, what, like England. We'll do, we'll do this. Yeah, so this is what you're going to do, right? You're going to do this. Give all this joint up. Give all this up. And then uh, you're gonna get the two silver players. And then this is how you're gonna get those Bolivian players, how you're gonna get those Bulgarians. And there's one more nation that's really expensive. Uh, is it Venezuelans? No, it's um, Poland. No, it's not. It's Bulgarian, Bolivian, and there's one, oh, Saudi, Saudi. This is how you're gonna get Saudis as well. So there's three nations that you need to get to complete those. Um, and like I said, they are pretty expensive. So this guy is saving us like what, 1K? Uh, but yeah, that's what you're gonna do. You're gonna repeat those. And like I said, guys, it's pretty, pretty simple to craft for Jorginho. Just do the methods that I told you guys. Do bronze pack method, bronze upgrades, and then do your uh, league SBCs right here. And with the fodder that you're going to be getting, I'd say if you ran through the Americas, guys. No, no, no. If you ran through Europe in one whole sweep by doing bronze pack method, you're going to have enough fodder to probably complete uh, both Jorginho and Declan Rice. So it just completely depends on your luck. That day you could go through every single one of these and not pack a single walkout. And you could do one random Asian one and on your first one you could pack like Neymar or Summer Stars, okay? So it's all based on luck. But definitely, definitely, definitely take advantage of that advice I told you guys of completing Yeri Mina. That's a 95 rated car that's gonna go straight into Jorginho. And then go ahead and complete these European ones right here or whichever ones, Asian, Americas, whichever one. Get all these cards right here and that's gonna be enough fodder to build your team even if you're a brand new account so uh thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed the video leave a like don't forget to subscribe um and comment down below what else you guys want to see if you're enjoying the videos it helps me out a lot to keep making these and yeah i'll see you next time thank you for watching peace